Hi everyone, it's my and my son here. First of all, I hope you are happy and healthy at your houses. Please take care and stay well. So for today is a different content, but um, I finished my first year of architecture. And here are, my, here are some of my works from my first year. It was full of work, it was so tiring, and I want to say that please comment down below if you want to listen about architecture, but not only that, an architecture student's life, because it is not easy, and I can say that it is a bit unusual. <laughs> There's so many stuff to tell, so please let me know if you want to hear about those. So, it's a different content today. Being an architecture student also means that you have to know about nature and history. And for today's video, I'm out in Denizli, in Turkey, exploring nature. Let's explore it together now. So here we see a welcome sign in Denizli, Turkey, the botanical garden. To enter, you have to take a couple of steps and enter from this beautiful entrance. They didn't open the place on the left side, but it was nice walking outside. There were different paths that led to different, led to different places, but I didn't have much time to wander around everywhere. I hope I can do that one day. There were a lot of species of the plants. I don't know every one of them. It was sometimes hard to read. I didn't want to step on the grass to look to some. But I hope you can read. I tried to zoom in as much as I could. I liked the fact that they limited the board, like they put these irony things on the path so you know where you're walking. And it's just a one way, like you see, it's, it looks magical. The plants were in different colors. The grass was all shiny, the sun was shiny, you can see a um, solar system. No, <laughs> what? No, so, no, it's not a solar system, the solar energy thing. There. And of course some flowers. It's October and the water was just like spring actually, which was so beautiful. You can even see the bees there. They put nature all together, the rocks, some stuff made of wood, and all types of plants. So I don't want to really say that they ruined the mountains because it's kind of far from the university there, the only university in Denizli. I definitely think that it had a good city plan there. Well, at least district plan, you get me. Where there we can see a clean house, no, clean energy house there. And besides that, there was a visitor house, guest house. And just look at those designs. I think they should have put a those step on the grass sign there because I know some people did. And it's best not to, even though some plants are, were put in the grass and it was hard to read. So I'm not sure if it's allowed, but normally it isn't. <laughs> and just look at that, they made this a bit left and a bit right. And this wooded floor, it definitely shows that they also put nature in together. They didn't use any concrete, which is amazing. There were also bird houses in some trees, which also invites the birds. So you feel like you're in clean nature. There weren't any benches, so you could eat and um, mess. So that was it for today's video. Thank you so much, so, so, so much for watching. I hope you liked and please subscribe if you haven't. And you can also share this video because it's my almost first different content in this channel. And I want to share 
with the nature just with you because as an architecture student I know that I can't stay limited with only drawing certain stuff that's why I hope you liked it I worked on it and I hope it was worth it and excuse my English uh, <laughs> stay safe and healthy everyone